The latest on Arthur keeps it a tropical storm, but just barely. I do expect by morning that this will be a hurricane still moving north and by morning it's going to start to make that curve off to the northeast, so it will be moving offshore. Winds right now 70 miles per hour and the, the track on this still takes it offshore of the Grand Strand by about 75 miles or so 80 mile per hour hurricane as it moves past our area tomorrow. That is close enough that we will see tropical storm conditions along the Grand Strand winds gusting up to 50 miles per hour 2 to 4 inches of rain. So it is going to be a wet and wild day tomorrow. But the good news is tomorrow night it is out of here and it will be long gone by the 4th of July. Gorgeous weather returns on Friday. Friday and it will continue into the weekend across our area. Our weather headlines for tonight. It's going to be warm. It will be muggy. Worst weather coming up for tomorrow, but it will clear and we will see a lot of sunshine for the 4th of July. As far as the wind forecast, the areas in yellow that is tropical storm force wind. Notice along the Grand Strand, we will see those winds sustained up to 40, gusting up to 50. Hurricane force winds staying off to our east, likely even east of Wilmington, but the Outer Banks, uh, Cape Hatteras is going to get a bad Bad storm out of this by Friday. It is gone and moving up to the northeast rainfall for us two to four inches of rain right along the coast. Get west of Conway and we're talking about just scattered showers and thunderstorms. It will be a breezy day tomorrow across the PD, but a typical summertime day with that chance for a thunderstorm across the area throughout the day and waves. We've been watching the waves down off of Charleston earlier today. Two foot waves right now 10 foot waves and you can notice the brighter colors about to move around Cape Romaine. So so our, our surf is getting rough and it will be a rough day for tomorrow. So our forecast for tonight, mostly cloudy, a warm and muggy night. Temperatures will be in the 70s for our overnight lows, mid to upper 70s right along the coast. A very tropical feel to our atmosphere tonight. For tomorrow, a stormy day along the Grand Strand, heavy rain, strong winds all day long. The strongest wind will be during the afternoon hour. Inland areas will be partly cloudy with scattered thunderstorms. Still a breezy day and it will be warmer inland with temperatures in the lower 90s. Our three degree guarantee for tomorrow. Myrtle Beach is a city. 86 degrees is the forecast high. If I can get that correct within three degrees, Glass Pro will donate another $100 to the Wounded Warrior Project. At the beaches for tomorrow, tropical storm warning. It, very dangerous rip currents, winds east 25 to 40, waves 6 to 10 feet. Do not go to the beach tomorrow. Don't go in the water because it will be dangerous. Seven day forecast looking rough for tomorrow, but the nice weather returns for the 4th of July and it's going to be a beautiful weekend. Lots of sunshine Friday and Saturday. Just a small chance for a few thunderstorms around on Sunday. And then next week we have the typical heat and humidity back with those pop up afternoon showers and thunderstorms. And really tomorrow it's going to be just along the Grand Strand, even west of Conway. Not much may be going on. It's just going to be a breezy day, but we will see sunshine across the PD. All right, Frank, we appreciate you keeping us up to date on all this. Mm -hmm. Thank you.